Transpirational pull is a crucial mechanism in the process of water movement through plants. It is a part of the larger process known as transpiration, which involves the movement of water from the soil, through the plant, and into the atmosphere. Here's a detailed breakdown of the concept. Water is absorbed by plant roots from the soil. This water contains dissolved minerals essential for plant growth. Once inside the plant, water travels upward through specialized vascular tissues called xylem vessels. The movement of water through the xylem is driven by several factors, including root pressure and capillary action. Water reaches the leaves, where it plays a critical role in photosynthesis. Leaves have tiny openings on their surfaces called stomata. These stomata regulate gas exchange, allowing carbon dioxide to enter for photosynthesis and oxygen to exit as a byproduct. During this process, water vapor is also lost to the atmosphere. The loss of water vapor from the plant to the atmosphere through the stomata is called transpiration. As water evaporates from the leaf surfaces, it creates tension within the leaf and xylem tissues. This negative pressure, or tension, generated by the evaporation of water from the leaves creates a pulling force. This force is transmitted down through the water column in the xylem vessels, effectively pulling more water up from the roots to the leaves. This continuous column of water molecules is maintained due to the cohesive and adhesive properties of water. In essence, transpirational pull is the result of water vapor loss from the leaves, generating a suction force that draws water upward through the plant. This process is vital for transporting nutrients from the soil, maintaining plant turgor pressure, and cooling the plant through evaporative cooling. Thanks for watching. If you learned something from this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Bioscholar for more interesting insights into the plant world. Leave a comment below if you have any questions or topics you'd like us to cover. See you next time.